Today I learned that from a biological point of view, vegetables don't actually exist. All food items we call vegetables can actually be labeled as a real plant part. Carrots are roots, lettuce is leaf, uh, uh, you, you get the idea. Wait, did people still think vegetable was a category of life and not just a food word? Since I see some folks in the comments still confused over this, vegetable is a purely culinary word. Fruit has both a culinary and a biological definition. And yes, the culinary definition can sometimes contradict the biological definition. It's also why a tomato is a fruit is technically true, but a tomato is a fruit, not a vegetable, is false. Also, I love this factlet because it also allows me to say this objectively funny phrase, vegetables are a social construct. Oh my god, I'm using that. Hey! What the fuck? Seals are so, so fat, I love it. As a soon-to-be marine biologist, I must agree, they are, and it is amazing. See? One out of one experts agree! Why are colds like, eh, I'm cool. They've taken the bridge and the second hole. We've barred the gates, but cannot hold them for long. The ground shakes. Drums. Drums in the deep. We cannot get out. A shadow lurks in the dark. We cannot get out. <gasps> they are coming. You see, in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Part 1, Phantom Blood 1987, Robert E.O. Speedwagon is attracted to men. A subtle nod to the fact that he is gay. <laughs> I don't know why that was a very did you know moment, but I love it. There's so much fuss over which spouse should change their last name after marriage. Can we all just please act like adults here and go to fantasynamegenerators.com and let the warrior cat name generator decide? Really? Be civil. Yo. You came to the wrong neighborhood, Oni-chan. <laughs> you're playing WoW Classic. <laughs> you know Fable 2 exists, right? Wow, you're playing Fable 2? You do realize Mountain Blades exist, right? You're gonna play Blair Mountain Blade? Why not come join me in my Viva Pinata Heaven? Oh, you're gonna Viva Pinata? Why don't you come do rocks with me? What the fuck just happened? If you don't watch a series entirely, you are not a true fan. If you do watch a series entirely, you are not a true fan. You're only a true fan if you're powered by electricity, have multiple flat blades, and spin around really fast like <laughs> My favorite type of characters are they are not dumb, but they are a dumbass. Characters with enough intellect and common sense to clearly and easily grasp that something is a bad idea, but with enough chaotic dumbass energy to decide they gotta just go ahead with it anyway, are on point. Um... I just... I just... yeah. Oh, Nikola Tesla's super adorable. He's just wandering around and hiding under the things. Go squeal. <clears throat> I should probably specify that Nikola Tesla is a cat, and Serbian American inventor Nikola Tesla is not wandering around my house hiding under things because he's dead. I like the implication that if he were not dead, he probably would be wandering around your house hiding under things. Nick, Nikola, what are you, what are you doing under there? Y you gotta work on your electrical stuff. Get out from under there. No, he's licking his lips. He's checking it twice. Five minutes left on his microwave rice. Gotta put some sauce over that shit. It's either vibe or be vibe. The vibing. So in terms of fandoms, I'm the opposite of a gatekeeper. I get into something and I won't stop talking about it until a bunch of people follow me through the gates. So, you're Pied Piper. Hey, what do you call a werewolf YouTuber? A like and subscribe. The only way to stop them is to ring that bell! I don't know if y'all Americans in that know this, but in Australia, instead of snow at Christmas, we get these little shiny bugs everywhere and they're attracted to Christmas lights and we call them Christmas beetles. And despite being Australian, they don't bite or anything, they just crawl around in your hand and it's such a good and pure feeling in me. Yeah, despite being Australian. We know what you're thinking, but this does not want to kill you. Dumb dumb idiot here to tell you to love yourself. And why should I listen to you? Because it's 5 a.m. where I live and I'm willing to hurt anyone at this hour. Now this raises the ultimate question. Did Puckett Show get up early, or is he just going to bed? The horse has been caught at last. Hospital board to vote on letting it back into the hospital. Not certain his presence in hospital was as bad as we thought. And then in a shocking, mind-blowing twist, hospital board revealed to be made entirely of horses. Hmm. Colonel Sanders, the chicken alchemist. The fuck? Ooh, my crystal ball says you're really fucked up this time. Yo, this is rolling one on a divination check. Does anyone else feel like a weird inhibition against starting a new TV show? Like there are shows I want to watch, but when I think about sitting down to start, it's something in me just goes, no, you can't do that. 
What am I waiting for? I feel like I need to prepare. You have to wait. Wait for what? You have to wait. <sighs> I feel that with a lot of shows. Helpful grammar tip. Farther is for physical distance, further is for metaphorical distance, and father is for emotional distance. Who, who hurt you? My father, did you not read the post? Oh my god, there's a swan up for adoption, you boy? Okay, see you guys later, I'm gonna get myself a swan. I'm a name in a corn. Someone posted this on, oh, hold up, my Discord? They told me to name a corn. Oh my god, my Discord actually convinced somebody to A, adopt a swan, and B, name a corn. <sighs> what the fuck? I hate it when parents are like, I know you better than you know yourself. Like, no, no, you don't. Like, oh, you're an expert on the inner machinations of my psyche? Name three of my top ten as extensional dreads. People without ADHD be like, oh, if I get rid of all my possible distractions, then you'll be forced to focus on the boring task. Fool. You underestimate my power. As long as I have flesh, I have a distraction. Oh, shit, I forgot the end of the episode. Sorry, I was looking at something on my phone. Oh, shit, I also have to do, like, the perfectly got scream. Uh, uh, uh.